Is Melvin Manhoof the scariest explosive fighter? Melvin Manhoof may be the most explosive guy in all of K1 and mixed martial arts. This fighter is the epitome of scary. In ring entrances, he walked out in a spiked dog leash. And when he took the chain off, he was truly unleashed. In his epic fights, he fought with pure offense with little regard for defense. There was never a dull moment, he either knocks his opponent out or he gets knocked out. Simply watch him fight to understand why his nickname was called the Hitman with no mercy. With the power to end any fight with one shot, he was the first person to knock out the K1 Grand Prix champion Mark Hunt. Even more impressively, he did it in 18 seconds. In post-fight interviews, he says he lives for fighting. I live for this shit. With a body chiseled like a Greek god, even when he's just dancing, he's explosive and scary. When Badahari is going off on an aggressive rampage, he is the only one who dares to step in to calm him down. Fight fans, welcome back to another episode of Lawrence Kinchin Striking Breakdowns. In this episode, we feature Melvin Manhoof, the quintessential explosive scary fighter. My name is Melvin Manhoof. My nickname is Melvin No Mercy Manhoof. Melvin Manhoof is arguably the most explosive brawler of all time. In MMA, he has the highest knockout ratio. 29 out of his 32 wins are by knockout, a whopping 90% knockout ratio. If Manhoof can land his left hook or right hook clean, it puts everyone it touches to sleep. Best weapon in the ring. I have the highest KO ratio. But my best weapon is my left hook. Knock okay, everybody out. My right hook, I knock everybody out. My uppercut, I knock everybody out. My kicks, they are hard. Kicks everybody out. Me, I need somebody out. Everything of me is dangerous. He is the classic pure fighter. Rarely will he move back without swinging haymakers himself. Take his fight with Mark Hunt for example. Hunt is one of the heaviest hitters in kickboxing history and a K1 Grand Prix champion no less. He charged at Manhoof with an overhand and a shifting cross. Just as he's trying to gain his base, Manhoof already landed a check hook and a right hook. In just 18 seconds, the Hitman finished the K1 champion with an iron chin, being the first person to truly knock out Mark Hunt. Just look at the way he celebrates after this fight, pushing his cornerman and jumping onto the ropes. Truly a scary sight. Whenever he gets into trading range, Manhoof disregards defense and does not care whether or not he gets hit. Manhoof simply swings for the fences because he has faith on hitting way harder than his opponent. With so much explosive power, Manhoof is way more comfortable brawling than most of his opponents. And when you look at how explosive he is, it's obvious to understand why. The powerful hooks he unleashed in the trading distance bring sheer terror to his opponents. Against Cyborg Santos, both of them were willing to trade with each other. At one point, both of them gassed out from all the haymakers they were throwing. But as soon as Manhoof gained the energy for a big combination, he put Cyborg to sleep. Now why does Manhoof fight like this? Hear it from the man himself. We call like fighters. That means we have to fight. We are gladiators, you know? Uh, this is how I see it, you know? We come in the ring and we're gonna fight, you understand? You know, and we are fighters fighting with the heart, you know. You know, if you don't throw punches, you never make gaps, you understand? I throw a lot of punches and I, I come in like wild and I, I do everything. That's why you get gaps. That's why you lost also, you know. But, you know, 
and his this is his game and you have to respect that you know yeah his game i respect it but i find it you know give the audience something you know let me fight let me bang yeah you know and i think that's much better you know out of all of manhood's combinations he is most dangerous when the opponent charges in he hits them with a chair cook and then finishes them with a right hook Manhoof's next best combination is the overhand right into the left hook. If he misses the overhand, no problem, it loads up his powerful left hook. The scariest part is that any shot can put his opponent to sleep and another shot would follow. Like this overhand left hook low kick scene. He was able to do this to multiple opponents. When Manhoof was younger, he was so explosive that he could miss a kick onto the ropes and still explode into a finish. For example, he kicked so hard that his leg flew into the ropes. Normally people just reset into this position, Manhoof somehow came back with a heel kick and immediately sprinted into an explosive combination. It's safe to say that no one in history fought like him. The Hitman with No Mercy is definitely one of the most exciting fighters of all time in combat sports. What do you think of his fighting style? Let us know in the comments. If you enjoyed this episode, please support us by watching another one. I'm Lawrence Kenshin and thank you for keeping our channel alive.